Well, hello everybody. I know it's been a little while since I've uh, updated. I just want to show you I've got some of my floor put in. It looks really good, I think. And I've got most of it, and I just need to do all these edges and stuff. And uh, it's really starting to look nice. I got some cupboards today um, for my kitchen. You can see them over there. I took these uh, mirrored ones here out of my RV. And that's going to be my door for this cubby hole up here. A two-sided door that I can get in. And I just got to you know, trim up these edges here. I'm going to put some of the ceiling stuff on there. And so that's all sealed up. A little bit over here and across the front. And uh, finish this trim up over here. Um, then I'll... Then I'll, I still have to glue down my counter and um, wait for it to dry and stuff. But um, I figured while it was getting glued down and I was waiting for it to dry, I could start rubbing tongue oil on stuff. I got some uh, mineral spirits to thin it down because it was, uh, it was just it was way too thick. So I got a light today for this side above my desk. Um, I think I need to reposition it. It's exactly between the door and the counter so I don't know but it's offset from the window because the windows to the left of it so I'll either move it directly over the window or I'll leave it where it is because it's centered from the door and the cupboard it's where I originally intended to put the bottom window I suppose but I don't know it's just bad planning I've made a lot of those types of mistakes but I'll put some uh, wall trim on that so it doesn't look like that um, it'll look like the regular pine trim on the sides um, I might go all the way to the ceiling there and then put a piece across the top I don't know if I'll close that in or not I probably will though and uh, and then I'll trim out that window on the top up there and I'll trim out this window I think I still want to put a piece of glass or a piece of mirror on this window I'll leave that just how it is. I think that's going to bounce a lot of light in here from that window. It might not, but we'll see. Um, you know, just turning, turning these guys towards it kind of bounces a little light around too. So, I don't know. Um, we'll see what's going on with that a little later on. But I like how they sit there, and that will be my opening for that with those mirror those mirrored things there. I'm hoping it'll bounce light around, but we'll see. I'm not hope I'm not counting on it, but I still don't know if there's room for my microwave over there or not. I might end up putting it by the coffee pot here or something. Um, maybe I'll put a shelf over here and I'll have my microwave over here or something. I decided to tear that out. I don't want to use it as a table. I'm just going to end up putting it in my shop, using it as a storage container. Uh, my bedroom is still full of stuff, all my tools and stuff. A lot of this stuff can be moved out of here now. I really just need my cutting tools. Um, I have a few electrical outlets still to put in. I want to put on the faces and stuff, but um, I got to do the tongue oil and stuff first. But it's getting so close now, guys. We're almost done, and you know it does look a little odd with that off color. Uh, finish on that so I might sand those down so they're the same color as everything else which is a little lighter and then just put tongue oil on there to finish them up but make them you know match match the rest of my interior decor better or maybe I'll even paint them white I don't know but I think it looks good like that um, this cupboard here I'm actually probably going to um, turn it backwards. Put a little. I'm going to put a little stud in here, in the middle here somewhere, and so I can have it open the same way as this one. So it'll open like this, you know, like this. Open like that, so I can actually get to it. Right now, I'd have to like duck and stuff to get into this side. So it's just because of. Uh, where my refrigerator is and stuff, but I want to still be able to have access to it. 
So I'm going to turn the door around. These hinges will be on that side and then it'll open like this and this will open like this. And that's what I will do to fix that. Um, I've got lots of trim and stuff and so it'll be easy to make that little thing to hold the hinges on and stuff. So that will all look good and then I'll fill that space with trim of some sort so that we can't see that space in there. And then I like it. I think it'll work good up here like this. And I wish it was daytime so you could see, but you can see from the reflection, at least, you can see where the roof is in the reflection, right? So that's going to bounce up down, you know, in this direction some somewheres. You know, probably to the floor, right around in here somewhere. But at least it will light up the place more. As it is right now, I do not need lights during the day. Um, if it's kind of a foggy day, I sort of need a little bit of lights, but not really at all. I can see totally good in here without any lights during the day. Um, I put little plugs on this trim right here. When they, I glued them on, and when they get all done, I'll, I'll sand them down smooth like the rest of the stuff. And uh, there's a few things I have to fix still. I still have to put some trim down that side. I have to put some trim down that side. And then when I do that, I still, you know, I've got a lot of trim to do, but those are the only two big pieces left on my bedroom. I still have to do something with this down here, but I want to make some kind of cupboard so I can get down there at least. And uh, cause I got a little bit of space right there and I have a little bit of space right there. So. Um, I was originally going to put my drawers in there, but that didn't really work out. Here, I'll show you why. I'm just going to set you down next to this for a second. Grab a drawer. Uh, let's stick that somewhere in here. And, okay. So as you can see, the drawer sticks out quite a bit away from the edge, see? And I just didn't want people putting their feet on it or something or having to you know, extend my edge out to cover that up. So I just decided to try to make this instead. And I still need to finish the front up. I need to kind of square it up a little bit better, but I made a short little dresser out of those three drawers instead. So we'll see how well that works. I need to trim it out and stuff too. I might just end up throwing it away, but whatever. I want to make you guys a quick video, so there you go. Have a nice day. Peace.